Hey everyone, today we're checking out some of the best portfolio making tools and resources that will take your UX UI portfolios to the next level this year. Let's check these out and let's see which one is the best for you. All right, so the first one is called UX Folio and UX Folio is dedicated to creating UX portfolios. As simple as that. Here you'll find very key features that will help you out in making them. UX sections, which will have different sections, one for your portfolio projects, one for your about section, things like that. And you can quickly just drag and drop elements such as sketches, wireframes, etc. right into this page that you have here in a very organized format. So yes, you also have inbuilt 3D mockup. So if you upload a UI or a screen, it will instantly put it inside a MacBook or an iPhone or anything like that. It's super easy to do. You just click a few buttons and you'll have a live prototype working on your website. You can embed your designs from any platform, Figma, YouTube, Framer, Envision, Adobe XD, if you're still using it, you can do that as well. They also have a lot of different examples you can choose from. This one from Hana seems really stylish. It's very clean, very well built. And you would think this is built in something like Framer or Webflow. It's quite advanced as well. So you'll get all the features of an advanced web, web builder, but still will have this simple to use tool. Fortunately, they have a free plan. So you can have one portfolio with one case study completely free. If you ever want to, you know, spend on a proper website where you can even connect your domains, etc. So just like any other web builder, you can also get the premium for not $9 a month. Anyway, guys, we are hosting a two day Webflow workshop online where three of the most amazing mentors, including yours truly, uh, is going to be there. And we are completely going to teach you everything about Webflow designing websites from scratch to network with like minded designers just like you guys, because we'll have breakout rooms where you can actually talk to each other, uh, mingle, share numbers, etc. So it'll be a great opportunity to network as well as to learn a new skill, which is Webflow and you get certificates from us as well. That'll be really cool. So if you're interested in something like this, the link is in the description. I would never have thought that I would ever say this, but Canva's website builder. Canva last year launched its own web builder like Framer, but in this, they have all the easy to use Canva features for your website as well. You can just quickly pick up elements from Canva library. So you'll get all the Canva AI features, all the Canva ready-made assets that you I'm sure have seen before all here. So you'll have the access to all the other Canva tools while creating your website, which I think is pretty unique. And it's a lot of drag and drop action. So there's little to no learning curve for this. Okay, you have a few website builders, but what about inspiration for good portfolio projects, case studies, etc. Well, wall of portfolios has you covered from designers from the top companies in the world, startups, Microsoft, Netflix, Flipkart, Zomato, Cred, Swiggy, Google, the list goes on. They have curated hundreds of portfolios of the top designers of top companies. Some of these guys are even influencers and YouTubers just like yours truly, but they have some very, very good work from all these wonderful people all live here. So you don't even have to navigate to another website. You'll be able to check out their websites from here itself, from inside the walls of portfolio. Each portfolio also has a connected person. So you'll be able to, you know, follow them. You might be able to get some mentorship out of these people. If they're open to mentor you guys, that would be really cool too. And honestly, some of these portfolios are mind blowing. It's so clean. They're so nice. And for the best inspiration, you should visit wall of portfolios. They also have a section called case studies. So different case studies for actual proper projects out there. Uber bus by Uber, Swiggy's, Swiggy collectibles, Blinkit projects, So a bunch of case studies from some of the top companies as well also exist on this platform, apart from the portfolios. You can even submit your own portfolio if you want it to be out there and more people should see it. And they might even be featured in some of these categories. So each portfolio is it's sent into categories, bento designs, minimalist portfolios, things like that. So go ahead, steal their designs, 
take ideas from them. I think that'll be pretty cool. Now, Notion is a great tool for note taking. You could turn a Notion page like this into a fully fledged functional website. You can do that with your portfolio. List out all your portfolio projects, your about and everything on a Notion page and use super.so to convert your Notion page just like this into a fully fledged website just like this. It has a completely free plan so it it's not paid or anything unless you want the paid plan with paid features and a lot of them look like fully fledged websites but in technicality it's just a notion page converted into a fully fledged website wow this looks like a proper company page i mean i would never be able to make out this was made through notion and all of this is functional so you can add transitions, animations, you can even shift from dark to light mode. Also to help you guys out, they've created tutorials and help guides to help you get started with super.so. All right, so this next one is actually a LinkedIn alternative, but you have a lot of portfolio creation tools on this platform. This is called Peerlist and off recently it's been garnering attention and it has some really cool sections including things like projects. So if you have a case study or project you're working on, you can release a project every Monday for the entire community to check out. As you can see, a lot of people have released a lot of different products, projects, designs, etc., on their platform. You also have an entire job listing here. So just like LinkedIn, it acts as a job listing platform. So you can find jobs from here and you can list yourself as open to work and you can make your profile look very good with behance like features so you can list out different projects add details for that project you can even link things like youtube medium reddit this is much more customizable than a linkedin profile all right so this next one is sort of a plugin for chat gpt that allows you to create better portfolio projects or portfolio websites now in this case this is called portfolio and this is a little plugin available on the gpt section now inside GPTs, you'll find portfolio and here you can ask a lot of different questions pertaining to what problems you are facing with your portfolio. So um, how do I make sure that portfolio stands out? Give me bullet points. As you can see in bullet points, it lists out portfolio related stuff and this is created by a company which is dedicated to this so you know a lot of these pointers are not just coming from chat gpt it's also coming from the insights that this company already has give me links to inspiration and as you can see it browses through the web and it gives you inspiration now most website builders for your portfolio projects will come with a subscription five dollars a month ten dollars a month what if i could tell you you could buy a software which is dedicated to creating amazing websites for portfolio projects, etc., and pay once. This is called Semplice, and their main objective is to provide you a tool without any monthly subscriptions. An individual plan, a studio, or a business plan, and even after one year, you can keep the website, you can keep the tool for free. You won't have to pay again for keeping the website. So this is one of those softwares. With the new version called Semplice V6, you get some very advanced web design features along with a lot of standard stuff that you get. You get a lot of different animations that you can create, uh, scroll animations, rebuilt sections, as well as customized elements that you can add to your projects. It even has a feature dedicated to portfolio creators called Advanced Portfolio Grids. And this feature allows you to create some beautiful portfolio sections where you can list out your work, list out what you have created in a very beautiful and seamless manner. Your website will truly stand out because this is actually legit premium quality. All right guys, that is it for today. But, but if you have any recommendations, if you want to share something with the community, let us know in the comments. I think the entire community will get a lot of help if you share your own resources. What tools do you use to create your own portfolios? That'll be really nice. Go ahead, subscribe to the channel and hit the like button if you liked this video. I'll see you next time. Until next time, take care. God bless.